This video is sponsored by The Great Courses Plus, but more on that later. Hello everybody, so welcome to today's video. Today I'm going to be showing you my apartment. This is my apartment tour video. And I'm so excited uh, to show you guys because this is the first time that I really invested uh, thought and money into making this my dream apartment. Since I'm going to be in a very difficult surgical residency, I wanted to be able to go home and escape into some, I don't know why I keep wanting to do, I wanted to go home and escape into something beautiful and comfortable and just me. Um, I wanted to make it like my sanctuary. So without further ado, if you want to check out my apartment tour, keep watching. Okay, so this is my front door. We're just gonna start all the way at the beginning. And if I turn around, um, this is my bedroom, my bathroom, kitchen, dining room, and then living rooms over there. Um, my apartment is 700 square feet and like 815 a month in rent, so it's pretty cheap. Um, I wanted it to be a pretty affordable. I'm just going to fill it with really nice furniture. It was kind of my idea. So it's not that big, but it's great for me. It's just me, so it's big enough. Uh, let's go ahead and start this way. This is my kitchen. It has um, marble countertops and the whole area has like wood flooring. I have some pretty cool appliances. Um, I've never had a European washer dryer before, but I absolutely love it. <laughs> it's like a washer and dryer in one. This dishwasher is awesome. But anyway, uh, yeah, I have these are shot glasses. I don't drink, but these are just all the random places that I've ever been. Some Starbucks mugs. And then up here I have my cool mugs that I've collected from various areas. Oh look, if you look up there, that's where I've applied duct tape because a rat came in and ate all my food. So yes, that's something new. I didn't know when I moved in, but hey. Over here I have my laundry supplies. Um, my pantry area. Uh, let's see, what do I have to eat? Just random stuff. Almost nothing, probably. And then in here, um, ooh, God, those are amazing. So yeah, this, this is my kitchen. There's really nothing to it. I don't know why I spent so much time in there. Anyway, next up we have um, my dining room and living room area. Um, over here we have a closet. We have a whole bunch of closets right here. This one is where I put my Louis bag, my handbag. These are my various jackets that I don't really use very often because it's warm where I live. Uh, my white coats. Uh, and some slippers, some house slippers. This is Calix's area. He has his little, he's like so spoiled. He has the best of everything. He has this awesome cat carrier that like opens up because he's kind of large. He has a cat tunnel, toys, catnip, pictures of himself, more toys. And like he eats only this Prescription Hill Science Diet Perfect Weight Food because he's overweight. And then down here is his litter box area. So I mainly keep this door closed and just leave it cracked open so that he can enter. That one's boring. This is also equally boring. But I'm really proud of myself because I have a broom and a Swiffer now, which I had didn't always have some luggage bags. All right, so that's that area. This is where Calyx eats. This is my really cool design idea. <clears throat> so yeah, maybe I should have aligned these better, but over here, this is my high school diploma, college, med school. My diplomas and awards and this is a whole bunch of really important books and paintings and whatnot from my fans. This is a really cool photo because it's my worst evals from third year. But guess what? I still graduated. And then a little cool lamp and plant. 
more cat toys lying around the floor. Over here, you can see Kalis in his natural environment, sleeping as he does. This is an amazing cat tree that I got from Amazon. Oh, I almost completely forgot my table. Over here, this is a table that I got from Wayfair. Don't shop at Wayfair. A whole bunch of my furniture is from Wayfair, but don't shop there. It's where I keep my laptop, study, here's some books for my residency. This is a giant whiteboard with my tasks of the week. This is a giant mirror that I have decorated in twinkle lights from Walmart, my yoga mat, some shoes, and then this is my um, pole. <laughs> My workout pool, my power pool, my sports, whatever. It's an X pool and uh, I use it to exercise. It's really fun. I don't live with anybody, so it's not like I'm doing any, whatever. Now this area is my living room and first we can look at the television and oh my, what is on the television right now? This series is called The Addictive Brain and it's on The Great Courses Plus. From just being a physician to just knowing people in my own life, very difficult to understand where other people are coming from and what they are facing. So I've been watching this documentary series to kind of understand what is addiction, why does it affect certain people more than others, what is the pathophysiology behind it, how can I help people who are suffering from addiction. You can find this series on The Great Courses Plus, which is a subscription-based on-demand video learning service with professors who are like from Ivy League colleges and universities and has top-notch lectures from all sorts of subjects. And the people who teach the subjects are like the best experts on it. And through your subscription, you can look at over 11,000 videos over any subject that could interest you, like science, math, history, literature, and photography. The Great Courses Plus is offering my viewers a free subscription that you can access at this URL or click on the link in the description below. Okay, so back to the living room. This is my rug that I got from I think Overstock, a table from Wayfair, candle from Bath and Body Works, couch from Wayfair, and giant pillows and a very fluffy blanket from Target. This TV I got from Amazon for like $250. It was so affordable and large. Um, and then just have a random box for the wires. And I actually have a patio which is kind of one of the selling points for me getting this place is I live right next to the most gorgeous tree, which I love. And then um, I wanted to get something that I could lay out and enjoy the scenery. And I got this wonderful bench from Overstock. I love Overstock. Shop at Overstock, not Wayfair. <laughs> Wayfair, is, Wayfair is just like screwed me over a lot while I was buying stuff from them. No offense, I mean the furniture is nice, but. So yeah, this is my living room. I spend a lot of time in here, relatively speaking. I don't spend a lot of time in my apartment in general because I'm at work often. But now let's go over to my bedroom area. This is one of my favorite, favorite paintings. Over here is my closet. Um, that's basically what I wear all the time. Some medicine over there. This is my closet filled with wonderful clothes and shoes. Over here I have a bathroom that there's really nothing to say about. <laughs> it's pretty standard bathroom. And then this is my bedroom that I absolutely love to pieces. I really, really outdid myself. So let's start this way. Um, I made this painting off of some YouTube tutorial, so it's really not difficult to make and it looks really gorgeous. This rug is from Overstock. These flowers are from Target and they go really well with the bedding that I got from Home Depot. It's like a pink rose with little flowers everywhere. That's a pillow pet. That used to be a thing. The headboard is from Overstock and it's so gorgeous. And this throw blanket is... Man, so old, it's from Z Gallery. So this is my bed, where I spend the most time. No question about it. I have a little diary and candle over here. Um, this is where I keep more clothes, like pajamas. These are the best pajamas. And a hamper for my laundry. Um, throughout the years of having YouTube, I've been able to afford some nice things and, well, not too many. Uh, 
so I wanted to showcase them since I love them so much. I don't own that many luxury items, so <laughs> there's a lot of pushing, but that's okay. So we have some pushing here. That's Stormy. This is a Tiffany necklace that I always... I get questions about it all the time. It's from Tiffany's. It was from my crazy ex and I took the necklace and ran. Um, these are some red bottom heels that I bought when I was like 19 years old with my, with my check from being a lab tech. Gucci belt. Um, that's Pip and Bushy. And then just to kind of bypass this really quick, over here I have more pushing. That's vampire pushing. These are Valentino heels. They, these have been my dream heels forever. And I have them in nude and in black. And then this is a Jimmy Choo bag. Pushing and some Victoria's Secret dogs. Over here, I have one of my favorite quotes. It's near and dear to my heart. The best things in life are free. The second best are very expensive. Tory Birch bag that I got on sale and on discount. People are always wondering where it's from. This is a Kate Spade beautiful business bag. These are just boxes from the things I already showed you. And more boxes. This. This. Oh my goodness. This is so... Oh, I love it so much. Um, these shelves are from Impressions Vanity, as it's Vanity. And this is from Wayfair. So this vanity is absolutely amazing. It has these top three drawers for your jewelry. My camera usually goes there. I have perfume set up over here. And then over here is this light switch that is so bright. And you can adjust the lighting over here. So make it more bright or less. This chair is also from Impression Vanity. Um, the vanity itself was a graduation from medical school gift. And then I kind of bought the shelves and the chair during their July 4th sale, which is really nice. In the shelves I have things like hair products, more hair products. This is like my hair section. And then over here I have my makeup, like my brushes, my random stuff, and my makeup bag. I won't cry for you. My lashes are too expensive. So yeah, that's this is my little sanctuary. I love it so much. Every time I walk in here, I feel like I'm living in a dream because it is so beautiful and appealing to my taste. Like this is me if I was a bedroom. All right, everyone. Well, we're back to square one. I'm such a lucky girl to finally have like my dream, my dream apartment. I love it so much. It took eight years, but I'm finally here. So anyways, everyone, I'll see you guys in my next video. Never forget that the struggle is real, but it will be worth it. Bye, everybody.